Hi, it's me, Slay by Jordan, and I'm about to move. Oh. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm gonna move! Guess what I'm doing? Again. Yeah, I'm moving again. <laughs> and here we are yet again. I'm moving! Working on a weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Y'all missed out my new apartment. I got the keys. I got the keys. <laughs> All right, y'all. So I just went to my old place, got some cleaning supplies. I also stopped by Target to get some new cleaning supplies. I got my wagon to bring all this stuff in right here. I got my vacuum. My Superweight Jack, my room and dustpan, and we're about to deep clean this new apartment. We gonna clean it physically, we gonna clean it spiritually, and yeah, we, we just about to get into it, y'all. I love the new place. I'm so happy to have my windows back. Oh. <laughs> so yeah, I'm not gonna show y'all me cleaning but um, I think the next clip for this will probably be when I'm back at the old house. I haven't packed anything in the old place, so y'all gonna see that entire process. Um, but yeah, the first thing I want to do was just start this off by getting my keys, you know, giving y'all a little sneaky, sneak, sneak peek. I'm gonna give y'all a better sneak peek at the end, end of the video, but for right now, I just want to show y'all that I got the keys to the new place and I am moving. Today is September second so yeah we about to get to cleaning and uh get my wi-fi set up get my camera set up all that so we about to do all that right now but i'm excited all right y'all it is like 10 o'clock at night and i'm finally done cleaning my new place it took me all day but you gotta deep clean when you're moving into a new place you gotta clean that thing physically spiritually I get all that bad energy, no bad spirits out the way, and you gotta clean your place, baby. Because God is not gonna bless a house in a mess. Period. Love my new place, y'all. At nighttime, the view is viewing. Like, I feel like 2000. When was I in my last place like this? Uh, that would be 2021. To okay, so fall 2021 to fall of 2022. It just brings back so many memories. I didn't move to I didn't move back to the same building, so yeah, you know what I'm saying. Whole new building, whole new new building. But it just gives you those same vibes. Like you can hear the clubs, you can hear the music, you can hear people, you know, just out. Side, you can hear the cars, see the fire trucks, the ambulances, the buildings, the windows. I just love it all. But we done for today. So we're about to head back home. And then the next clip in the majority of the video, I have to move out of my old place. Like we got it. I haven't started on anything and we got a lot to do. So stay tuned. Hey y'all, so it is Sunday, September the 3rd. So on the to-do list today, I need to go to U-Haul, get some boxes. I need to get some tape. Um, I need to go by the new apartment and figure out the loading dock situation. Um, the property, the assistant property manager, she told me about it and explained it to me and showed it to me, but I forgot because it was kind of confusing. So I need to go there and figure it out myself. And then I gotta stop by my friend's house. And then today what we're gonna do is get rid of all the clothes that we no longer want and then we're gonna donate them. Um, and I'll probably start on packing up my guest bedroom. So yeah, that's the agenda for today. So let's go. All right, y'all, we are back in the new place. I got my boxes from U-Haul and my tape. Um, and I did figure out the loading dock situation and I took a video of it so I can remember it. That way I can direct my movers and everybody else who's gonna come. That's gonna be, you know, bringing in big stuff where I have to use the freight elevator, where to go. So now we're about to head to my friend house and then after that, we're going back home. 
because it's time to handle business. It's time to handle business. Uh, so we made it back home. We got our boxes. We got our tape. We figured out the loading dock situation. I visited my friend. Now we're back home. I'm about to eat me some Kill Me Crazy. I got me a chicken pesto wrap. If you haven't tried Kill Me Crazy, get the chicken pesto wrap and get you some ranch too on the side. It don't even have to be that ranch. It can be ranch from anywhere else. Bust every time. So I'm going to eat, you know, get some energy because it's almost 5 o'clock and I ain't ate nothing today. And then after that, we about to get to it, so time to eat. All right, y'all, so here we are hours later. It is 10, 20 p.m. on Sunday. I'm finally about to do these clothes. As y'all know, I had surgery. That was my last video, so, um, and I lost weight before surgery, so I can't fit a lot of my things, like a lot, and they look very big on me. They make me look slouchy. They just make me not look good anymore, so it's time to let them go. So I'll be giving away a lot of clothes this year. So I'm about to go through all these clothes that's over there in the corner. Um, if I don't want it, it's going to the trash bag. And if I do want it, I'm going to put it in a bin for now. And then I'm going to make a box for it. Um, because I've been napping all day, I'm pretty sure I'm in a mood to just start packing this stuff up. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm going to do now. So cue the music. Let's get into it. All right, y'all, so these are all the bags I'm giving away out of my guest bedroom. So we have, let's see, seven bags. I'm going to still go through these clothes. So these are like clothes I usually wear on the regular. But let me show y'all my closet in my, in my, let me show you my closet. Because we about to go this one too. Because it's just crazy. So this is my closet. We are about to go through all this stuff. Yeah, we about to get this one together too. So we went through um, the guest closet and my closet. Everything in those four things I'm keeping. Um, everything right there I'm keeping. And everything that's in my room, the two things that's by my bed I'm keeping. But... We got a total of 13 bags, full bags of clothes that I'm giving away. I haven't even went through my shoes and my guests in my closet yet. But, um, I, yeah, I haven't went through the shoes yet in both of my closets. But I have went through the clothes in both closets. And I'm giving all this away. Now, I know it's like 12 o'clock midnight. But the Aries and me, I want to take this to the bin right now because for one it's 13 bags and i'm a little skeptical that 13 bags gonna fit in there and i'm thinking like dang i ain't even did my shoes yet but um i think we finna take these right now or at least put it in my car so let's do that And y'all, this is the clothing donation box I go to every single time I move. Then right here. Hope y'all enjoy the stuff. I'm back home from donating those clothes. And now we're going to go through. This is like my 
hair room slash where I had all my post-op stuff and just, you know, overflow. I'm about to go through all those shoe boxes right there. And I'm going to also go through the shoe boxes in my closet. And whatever shoes I want to donate, I'm going to put them in a bag. And I'll take those in the morning. I was going to put my clothes in a box. Start putting stuff in boxes tonight. But uh, when I be cutting that tape, uh, it, it be kind of loud. And I don't have a black Sharpie marker to mark my boxes to label them. So I'm going to just do that in the morning. I really don't want to interrupt nobody's sleep because, like I said, these floors and walls here are thin. And I understand some people actually have to work tomorrow, even though it's Labor Day. Um, But still, you know, I just like to be respectful. But tonight I did want to start on them clothes and them shoes. So I'm about to go through all them shoes. And, yeah, we finna see. All right, y'all. So those are all the shoes I'm keeping. I stack them and put them in the box. These are, I just got one bag of shoes that I'm giving away. And then those two boxes are empty. I'll figure out what to do with that. And then so for now, I'm going to get this trash off the floor. And we're going to leave this room just like this. And we'll be back at it tomorrow. Good morning, y'all. It is September the 4th. It's Labor Day. Remind me to stop moving, y'all. Like, I'm just not... I was tired last year and didn't want to do it, but, like, now, I don't want to do this at all. Like, I think I'm at a point in my life now where it's like, if I'm going to have to move, the moving company going to have to pack my stuff and move it, too, because I'm just over it. This is like... I've only been living on my own since 2019, and this is my fifth apartment. I just need to... <laughs> we need to get it together and stick somewhere and stick to it. But um, I'm about to go to the U-Haul store and get some more boxes. And then we're going to come back and we're going to start putting the shoes in the boxes. We're going to go in that guest bedroom closet, which is basically like my hair room. Gonna pack up all that stuff. I'm gonna pack up the guest bathroom. We're gonna try to get a lot done today. Um, I bought a new bed and mattress. I just bought that. I'll get that delivered and set up at the new place tomorrow. But we focus on today. Right now, I need to get this done. Y'all, I really just wanna lay in the bed and not doing that thing, but. We got to get it done. Oh, I hate it here. I hate it here. <laughs> but yeah, let's go put on some clothes and go do that. So, All right, y'all. We back at home now. We got some more boxes from the U-Haul store. So we about to build these boxes and start packing this stuff up. I've been dreading this whole process, this process the most, but we're about to get out of the way. Um... I booked my elevator time for tomorrow and Wednesday. I still got to book movers, but I'll do that uh, later. It's time to get to work now, so let's do that.
All right, y'all. So those are shoes I'm gonna give away, and then this is everything that's going to the new place. I got seven large boxes packed. I got two more large boxes. So now we're about to go into the. Don't mind my squeaky slides. So now what we're about to do is go into this. Oh, let me cut down. Let's see. Watching Talitha. Now this is what we're about to tackle next. This guest closet. We're about to go through all this hair stuff. Get all this stuff. Yeah, so we're about to tackle this next. So let's do that. And I know I'm going to have to stop and go to the U-Haul store. I'm going to get some extra large boxes because, yeah. Or either I'm going to need like 10 large boxes, but whatever. Let's get to it. Right, y'all so this is the state of this room those are clean clothes over there empty boxes over there those are empty um whatever you call them i got hair tools a bunch of hair products up underneath here hair just too much hair stuff miscellaneous stuff over there more hair stuff y'all i found some money in one of them boxes and i was just like oh um this is the guest closet. I'm still working on it. I got my overflow safe, my surgery stuff. These two are trash. This is trash. And then some more surgery stuff that's not trash. And then I got to go through this box too. But I'm just doing so many things at one time. Let me show y'all. So that's trash. I'm going to take to the trash chute. I'm going to put that in my car. This is what we got packed up over there so far. Um, this is what my counter is looking like. Miscellaneous stuff. More hair stuff. Hair stuff. Just all type of stuff. I did take everything off the fridge. This cabinet... That's empty. This is almost empty. I still got plates and cups. Um, yeah, I didn't even do that one. <laughs> Let me not show y'all that. This is empty. This is empty. That came with the apartment, so I'm gonna leave that like it is. That's empty down there. That's empty down there. Also, this is empty. This is where I had my silverware. And I think this drawer is empty as well. I got to empty out at the bottom, empty out these two cabinets. Also got to empty this out. Uh, yeah, but that whole side is done. I still got stuff up underneath the sink. And then, yep, I bought a new mirror. They better not break it when I move. <laughs> And then we about to build a box to put some shoes, some clothes, belts, hats, and probably my bags too. But this is my, this is my closet. And we about to finish this out now. Like it's really, really empty. So I'm just going to go ahead and knock this out. Just so I can feel like I'm accomplishing stuff. I know I am, but I just need to see it too. So let's do that now.
Alright y'all, my closet is officially empty. So this is one room that's completely done. Now we are in my guest bathroom. We're about to go ahead and clear this out because it isn't really much too clear. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I kind of just want to throw all that away, but some of that stuff I'm gonna keep. But I kind of just want to take all that stuff and just shoo. <laughs> I hate moving. I hate moving. I'm never, I'm not doing this again. I'm not doing this again. In order for me to like move again, I'm gonna absolutely have to hate my new, I mean, I'm gonna have to hate my new place, like to the core. Because me doing this again, it's just not going to happen. But I know I'm not going to hate my new place, though. We're just not doing this for a while. For real. I just can't. <laughs> I just cannot. I can't. <laughs> Let's get started. <laughs> All right, y'all, the guest bathroom is cleared out. And now we're about to, I've started um, taking some of this stuff off the bed. As you can see, I moved that white thing into the closet. So basically, everything alongside right here at the bottom I'm gonna call a junk company and this is gonna get removed. Um, still gotta pack up the surgery stuff and um, gotta put them hangers in a box. Um, but yeah, for right now, we're trying to knock a lot of this hair stuff down. I, this whole box is filled with hair stuff. Like, it's just too much. But it's like almost five o'clock. We still at it. I did go to the U-Haul store and get some more boxes. I got large and extra large. So, yeah. I'm over it, but got to get it done. The front closet is cleared out. It is 6.13 and the guest closet is cleared out. Um, of course, Wi-Fi, that came with the... Um, actually, no, I gotta. Um, I think I got to take that equipment back to AT&T. Um, everything you see on the floor here is going to be picked up by a junk company. I don't need any of this stuff anymore. Um, I'm about to uh, tape off my surgery supply box. And we doing some other things too. Like right now, I'm also, yeah, I'm doing like 50 million things at one time. I'm cleaning out um, up under all the cabinets and drawers and stuff. And those are empty boxes. And I got some more empty boxes on the side of the bed that I'm finna put in my wagon and take to the recycle room. So, yeah, we finna get all this out of the way because I need to see that I'm making progress. But, yeah, y'all, we still at it, y'all. y'all the guest bedroom is done i just got my wagon them empty um hampers over there i took all the sheets and stuff off the bed um we keeping the mattress the bed and the pillows we'll get a new comforter set 
Those clothes over there are all clean. Um, I don't know what I'm wearing the next few days, so I just left those out. And then on move-in day, I just throw all them in a box and then them the remotes to the TV and everything. But everything on the guest side is clean. Only thing I have left is the laundry room, which is in here in my gym stuff. We also have the kitchen stuff. Um, I love some snacks, um, some electronics. This is little stuff. This is not major. Just a few things in the freezer and then just one row in the fridge. Um, what else we got to do? Oh yeah, I'm about to throw all them dishes away. Um, still got stuff up underneath the cabinet. And, um, everything over here is cleaned out, though. That's clean. That's clean. All that's cleaned out right there. And then, this is clean. Everything is cleaned out up under here, too. And on this side as well. I think, yeah, that drawer clean too. I just dumped some plastic forks and stuff in this one. But that's going to get thrown away. So all that's done. I think everything done up here too. Yep, all that's done. I just got some plates and cups right there. This is empty. I got to get my seasonings. I'm going to do that tomorrow because that's just little stuff. I don't think I had anything up here and did it. And then I do my medicine cabinet and stuff. And then we also have my closet is done. I'm going to take all this stuff off my bed. But that bed is not going with me to the new place. So it's just going to stay here to the junk people get here. Or either I sell it and then I got to do my bathroom. Um, but that's not going to take long at all. So... I think we might be through for tonight. Um, I am about to throw everything in this dishwasher away besides my pots because I want my pots. But everything else, I'm going to throw it away. I don't even want gold stuff no more. It's not going to even fit the aesthetic of the new place. So, yeah, we finna throw all that away. Um, take them two trash bags to the trash chute, and then we're going to be done for tonight. We're going to pick this back up tomorrow. I am tired as hell. It is 9.13. I know I've been in for at least a good nine hours, for real. Probably more, but... Hey. If I don't do it, who's going to do it? So, yeah. Still got to book a moving company tomorrow. I already got my elevator times booked. Um, we get our new bed installed tomorrow morning. And then we get our TVs unmounted tomorrow evening. All three of them. So yeah, we we wrapping it on up, but I am tired. Um, I ate some Subway tonight, but yeah, I'm about to, after I take this out, I'm gonna just choose to not do nothing else. Unless I wake up in the middle of the night and feel like doing something else, like I'll probably do my bathroom or something, but yeah, we, we done, baby. Um, so yeah, let's just get rid of these dishes then. That's going to be it for Labor Day. Today is Monday, September the 4th. Peace up. Eight town down. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> as fuck. All right, y'all. Good morning. It is Tuesday, September the 5th. So right now I'm waiting for my um, people who's bringing my new bed and mattress to come. Um... And once we get done with that, we're going to head to Home Depot, get some cord cover kits um, so I can hide my cords um, when I get my TVs mounted tomorrow. I don't like to put all them holes in the wall. And then we're going to go back home and finish packing up this place. My um, people who deliver my bed just said they're like eight minutes away, so I'm just chilling for right now. And yeah, we getting this out the way. <laughs> All right, y'all, so we have the bed installed. I closed my shades because, honey, it be getting hot up in here, but our bed installed and moving day is tomorrow.
let's get to it. All right, y'all, so I'm at Home Depot and I got my cord covers. And now we about to head back to the place. All right, y'all, it is 5.30 on Wednesday. I done took a much needed nap. Now what I'm about to do is, um, I'm about to finish packing up this apartment. I think I'm gonna start in the laundry room cause I'm not doing no more laundry for today. And yeah, let's get to doing that. We have an emergency. It is some dye wasting out on this floor. Oh my God. Y'all, y'all, this done stained my floor so bad. I only had a few stains in the kitchen. Like, what the f Oh, that's just irritating me so much right now. Child. It's done. Now I can put that box back over there and we can get back to it. So TVs are unmounted. <laughs> I tried to record him doing it, y'all. That man took them TVs down so quick. Here's the living room one. Well, y'all, when I tell you, he was moving like a lightning bolt. <laughs> I couldn't even keep up. And then this is the one that was in my guest bedroom. And I labeled all the bags with the screws so and labeled the mount. So when they... When the moving company moves them, we don't get it confused. So now I'm about to put all the TVs and everything in here and line them up. And yeah, we're going to get back to packing up this kitchen and finish packing up my bathroom because that's the only thing left. I got to get all my medicines and stuff out of that cabinet um, and my bathroom stuff. And then put out my outfit that I'm going to wear tomorrow and finish closing up them boxes and we'll be done, y'all. All right, y'all, everything is packed up and ready to go. This is all of my stuff over here and all in here. And of course I got the bed, I'll show y'all that. Just got my guest bed in here with the mattress. Y'all already know I got the new bed delivered and then my old bed that's in my bedroom, um, I sold it. So the person is coming to get that next week. And yeah, in the morning, we're just gonna take the wine out the wine fridge, take my juices out the fridge and take that. I also got my uh, wagon ready. I'm taking that with me myself in the morning before the movers even come along with this box 
And then I got one more box in my room. I got my outfit for tomorrow right there. I got one more box, which is hair stuff and bathroom stuff. And after I take my last shower here in the morning, I'm going to take all that stuff and throw it in that box and seal it and we'll be done. So y'all, packing is officially over. Today was a breeze, but yesterday, no. And tomorrow is going to be a great move. I'm already claiming it and we out for the night, y'all. I look a mess. And y'all, this is my last night in the place. This is my balcony. The junk, comp the junk company is gonna come get all this stuff, but I just wanted to show y'all my little setup I had out here with the lights and everything. And the view of the pool was everything. That pool looks amazing. And then you probably can't see it, but right there, that's the King and Queen Towers in Sandy Springs. So I was able to see that, but yeah, this is my last night here. And yeah, it's been a vibe. Catch y'all in the morning. Good morning, y'all. It is moving day. I'm about to get in the shower and then I'm about to um head to the new place so I can um go move some things that I'm gonna move myself, just small things. And then we're gonna head back here, head back home here to the old place and Get this thing started. So let's get on up. It's 8 a.m. All right, y'all. It is 9.54 a.m. I just finished dropping off the stuff and putting it up at the new place on my own. My movers are already at my old place. So now I'm headed back uh, there. And um, we're going to go down to the leasing office, get the elevator, and get this move started. Every box is popped. Every box is popped. Every box is packed up so they can just rock and roll. And from the looks of it, the girl who was there a few minutes before I left has left the area. Cause I was gonna let them know like, she gotta move. I'm moving out right now, today. So she gonna have to do something else. Cause I booked this. I can't be nice today, baby. I gotta get, we gotta put me first. So we headed there now. Let's do it. All right, y'all, the movers are here. I'm so annoyed right now. They can't even get in the garage because it's a big ass 18 wheeler right next to it. I just want to get out of this building. They hate it here. Alright y'all, it's finally empty. I'm so happy to be leaving here. But I will miss the vibes, but yeah, I'm happy to be leaving. See ya. All right y'all, everything is inside. Sorry I didn't record them bringing the stuff in. Y'all, I just been cussing people out left and right today. I just couldn't do it. But everything is moved in. Nothing is broken. They did an amazing job. And they actually worked very quick. And um, I'm going to give them a shout out right now. Um, their name is ATL United Local Movers. I used them last year. And I used them again this year. And I'll be using them again when I move, which won't be for a long time. Because I'm not doing this no time soon, for real. If any of my friends watching, I'll be like, y'all, I think I want to move again. Slap me in the face because this was just too much. But now we're about to head to Target and, you know, unpack these boxes. This will be the end of this vlog. Stay tuned. We're going to have major apartment updates. We just got some lit stuff coming. So you want to subscribe. <laughs> All right, y'all. Working on a weekend like usual. Way off in the deep end like usual.